I'm sitting here with Sir Harry out of London, England. Okay, Mr. Sir Harry, can you state a little bit why you're here at Meetum? I'm here at Meetum to uh, meet my uh, sub publishers from around uh, Europe and, uh, and uh, meet new friends. How do you feel about the music business right now? Uh, very excited. The music and business is on the up. Uh, piracy is slowly being eradicated, very slowly. Um, That's good. That's good to hear, and I believe it's really I mean, happening. The, the uh, societies are paying out more money than they ever have done before. The trouble, what, the trouble you have got is that there's a ma massive divide um, between lots of and nothing. So for a writer, you can have a massive hit or you have nothing. And that's what the problem is. How do you feel about the uh, dance? Um, the music market in Europe with the dance music and the beats and um... Well it's not just Europe, uh, it's all about America as well. There, there, there are massive amounts of what they call electronic music, people like Dead Mouse, Swedish House Mafia, Eric Prince. And these guys are selling out 50 to 80,000. We know that because obviously we, there was a massive amount of Coachella this year. Um, and these guys sell a lot of records, a lot of downloads, a lot of download singles. And that's, that's good money for a writer. Because these guys do the beats, but they need somebody to write the lyric and do the, do the melody on it. So, it's a very good chance for a writer, an established writer, to come up with a great lyric, and that song can be put out with a vocal on it, rather than just uh, a, you know a, a track without any lead on it. Great. Now, where do you see your music with your publishing going right now, in the, in the next ten years? Well, we're we're aimed at the dance market, uh, pop and dance market, and uh, we're doing well at that. And uh, not necessarily where I come from, but it, it, it is working and it is growing. And um, the kids will download the records, and, and they don't want to, you know, if they like a great record, they'll, they'll download it, they won't pirate it. And as Spotify and all these things come on, online more and more, they start paying out a lot more money. You know? So, you know, it may only be two cents, but thousands and thousands of two cents make up quite a few dollars, and that's the way you have to look at it. Publishing's gone back to the old way. It's gone back to the old ways of nickels and dimes. You know? And that's what it was when it started, and the industry's gone back to where it started. And there are more singles being sold now than in the heyday of the singles. So that's got to be good news. Awesome. And why are you here again at Meetup? I'm here to see all my sub publishers, my friends, my family, my, uh, my, all my friends in the music business that can be bothered to come out to Meetup. And do you think Meetup has uh, gotten better with the time? No, Meetup has got worse with the times. But it's still a good place to meet people. You know, it's, it's, it's not like it was. Uh, I did like the excesses of the 80s and 90s, but I'm afraid they've all gone now. It's just. But look, I think the problem with Medium is there's a lot of digital people here. Not, no disrespect to digital people, but a lot of digital people here. And they come and go. In the old days, when Medium first started, um, you had publishing people and record people come to Medium. Primarily publishing people. Medium was set up with publishers. And they may move around, but they stayed in the publishing business. They just changed companies. But now you've got the new content manager of Vodafone, and, and it, next year he won't be there. He'll be doing something else. And that's what so you're not you're not making friends over the years. Unfortunately, there's a different crowd of people coming in every meeting, and that is sad. Okay. Well, thank you, Sir Harry. No, thank you, Sherry, for coming on to see me tonight. Thank you. No.